Vernier now offers two choices in dissolved oxygen probes, the dissolved oxygen probe and the Vernier optical DO probe. The dissolved oxygen probe is slightly less expensive, but requires several setup and calibration steps. The optical DO probe may cost a little more, but it's virtually plug and play. Let's take a closer look at the optical DO probe. The Vernier optical DO probe can be used to measure the concentration of dissolved oxygen in water samples tested in the field or in the laboratory. The optical DO probe is a luminescence-based optical oxygen sensor. This technology reduces the need to calibrate the sensor, no filling solution is needed, no warm-up time is required, and there's no need to stir the water while taking measurements since it does not consume oxygen. The optical DO probe has a built-in thermistor for automatic temperature compensation. Be sure to keep this metal dot submerged for the temperature compensation to work. A built-in barometer is used for pressure compensation. These features eliminate the need to recalibrate the probe at different temperatures and elevations. To prepare the optical DO probe for use, make sure the storage bottle is removed. Position the switch to either the milligrams per liter or percent saturation setting. Connect the optical DO probe to LabQuest 2. The optical DO probe will auto ID. You are now ready to collect data. To obtain measurements, rinse the tip of the DO probe with stilled water. and gently blot dry with a paper towel. Place the probe into the sample to be tested. Make sure that metal dot near the tip of the optical DO probe is immersed for temperature compensation to work. If you're taking measurements at temperatures below 15 degrees Celsius or above 30 degrees Celsius, allow more time for the temperature compensation to adjust and provide a stable reading. The optical DO probe is designed so that it can be submerged in a water environment for extended periods of time. The body of the probe and cable are waterproof, but the box containing the microSD card is not. If you're taking measurements in the field, you may want to purchase the optical DO metal guard accessory to protect the cap and help weigh down the probe when submerged. The reading of this fish tank is reading approximately 6.4. It will take 40 seconds for the DO probe to reach 90% of its final value. So you may want to wait a few minutes for this value to stabilize. When you have finished using the optical DO probe, rinse the tip with distilled water. And gently blot dry. Place the optical DO probe back into the storage bottle. And tighten. For additional information, including maintenance, troubleshooting, and product specifications, please refer to the sensor booklet or visit our website.